called WCIL, Centre for Inclusive Living. Like Wendy's organisation, we're a user-led group and support people across the borough with disabilities and long-term health conditions. We believe it's very important for people to make their own choices and decisions and to be able to live the same life as everybody else. The Impact Group has enabled all of us to work together and to come together to put on events like the one here at Queen's Cross this evening. This event is being run just before Christmas and it is a training session around the Care Act, a fun quiz and some workshops where people can learn some new skills and learn about what's in the community, including Dudley Adult Learning and other providers are here too. In a moment you'll hear from another member of the Impact Group who will be one of the payroll providers who works with us. We do hope that if you see this video and you want to know anything about social care or employing your own personal assistant, you'll get in touch with us and we'll be happy to help. Okay, my name's Rob Taylor. I'm the manager of A4E, uh, one of the um, support providers for people in receipt of diet payment and personal budgets. I'm Margaret Burden. I actually work for Ideal for All and we're a support service on the framework for Dudley as well. We provide um, payroll and also employment support and I'm the self-directed support advisor, manager of the team. Um, together we, we, we do similar jobs, it's just giving the client the choice of provider who they want to go to. Um, we offer similar services um, and um, the um, support is ongoing um, so you needn't feel alone. Um, when you go on the journey with diet payments because of you're always somebody there to support you. Um, whether you dip in lead service or you need constant support, you'll always have a dedicated advisor um, to meet your outcomes. Hello, my name is Sam Andy. I've been asked by Black Country Partnership for Care to do a very brief summary on the Care Act that comes into effect April 2015. What I'm going to try and do today is instigate some discussion around how it may affect uh, the participants tonight, especially those who are individual employees who engage their own personal systems. My name is Jenny Kingston I work for an organisation called Black Country Partnership for Care and I administer the Impact Group which is made up of a variety of providers from across Dudley uh, and um, user-led organisations. Uh, Dudley um, MBC, Skills for Care and Job Centre Plus and the Impact Group are here to support uh, direct payment recipients and their personal assistants uh, with sector updates, with training, funding for training and events like tonight's event. Keep it funny and keep it short. <laughs> so I'll do as many or as few little verses uh, as you want. Now, before I start, I used to be a GP, but don't hold that against me, and uh, I had to retire about 10 years ago because I, uh, I lost my eyesight, and I wanted to do pottery, but I ended up doing poetry instead, so <laughs> we, we may as well get started here. Um, this handsome fella here is Lyle, and I drive a Porsche. Sleek and black. <laughs> I cruise around there and back. My Porsche is of the canine kind. Lyle is my guide. You see, I'm blind. Now, what I call, I've had Lyle for about four years now. And as you can see, he's quite a big dog. In fact, I call him the big galoot. He weighs seven stone. I'm barely five foot. 
Hobby's fully grown. <coughs> the big galoot. When people foresee us, they think, what a hoot. Where's his saddle in, mister? <laughs> the big galoot. But when we go walking, they say, what a beaut. Oh, yes, he's a cracker, my big galoot. But ladies and gentlemen,